Nasty in here with me. This ain't a diss song, but um, yeah, uh huh, you know what it is. I'm a cheesehead, y'all niggas cheese whiz. Pittsburgh Steelers, that's nothing. That Super Bowl ring, that's nothing. Yeah. Pull up in your town when you see me, you know everything. Green and yellow, green and yellow, green and yellow, green and yellow. Yeah. I put it down, representing for my team. I'm in green. How does a kid from Riley, Kansas, population 950, a walk-on at Kansas State, become the second all-time in touchdown receptions, third in receptions, and fifth in receiving yards for the Green Bay Packers? Cutting it back, Philly. He's going to go all the way. 10-5. Touchdown, Jordy Nelson. A lot of work, and I'd say a lot of luck, too. It's keeping the game simple, um, doing what you're asked to do, doing what you're coached to do. Um, keeping your head down. You know, it's the game's a lot easier than what, a lot simpler, I don't want to say easy because the game's not easy, but it's a very simple game if you keep it that way and stay focused on the main priority. That's, I think, what I focused on all the way through was to keep it simple, do what I was asked to do, work hard, and, you know, make the most of the abilities that God gifted me. Touchdown! A sensational catch by Jordy Nelson! Now you seem to have a special connection with Aaron Rodgers over the years. What was it that made your connection so special? Time and work. Um, I, I don't think is anything we did special. Um, it would be interesting to see what he would say and why. One thing we always said about him to the young guys is you got to make the plays in practice. That's where it starts. He'll give you opportunity in practice because in practice he can take chances, he can do different things. And once you become reliable and be where you're supposed to be and when you're supposed to be there, form that timing and do that in practice, and that builds over into a game. Once you do it in a game, it just starts snowballing. They fake the handoff. Rogers. You said you put together that little highlight film, and it was interesting to really look at it from a different angle of, you know, press coverage man-to-man, -man, and he just takes a three-step drop and throws it. I mean, that's the confidence that you build that started out, you know, across the street from Lambeau Field and all the hours we put in out there, and then it made the game simple. You watch that highlight film, half the plays would go, Aaron Rodgers rolling out right, heaves a ball downfield, 50 yards, Jordy Nelson <laughs> touchdown. Why were you such a big play threat for this Green Bay Packer offense? It just fit well for whatever reason. We There was a couple years there that, that, I mean, when those got called in the huddle, we it was almost a guarantee. I remember the Jets game vividly. We screwed up early and let them in the game, and they just scored to tie it, and it was the first play, I think, coming out of a kickoff. And we ran, ran the deep out and up, and it was a touchdown, and I think everyone in the huddle knew it was going to happen. When you have that confidence in one another, you know, you gel that way, it's, it was a fun time. Now, you do have a lot of accolades from your career, but if you could pick one memory as your fondest memory, what would it be? Oh, man. I'll take the Super Bowl out just because it's a, I mean, I think if you it's don't, yeah, I know, it's, it's an easy, easy answer. It's, it's, easy super, it's all of ours. <laughs> right. It's an easy one. right. But I think um, coming back from the ACL, um, that whole year process from when I tore it to the rehab, the maintenance all year long to make sure I played 16 games and get into the playoffs with it, and then winning comeback player of the year meant a lot to me. You know, it meant a lot to Nate and Flea in the training room. Again, it wasn't anything special we did. We just put in the time and we worked and did what we were supposed to do. and. The rest of the care of itself. How do you hope Jordy Nelson, the football player, will be remembered? Hopefully in a good way. And I, I mean, that's all I can say. It's Everyone's going to think of it a different way. Um, everyone's been extremely nice. If you look at social media or whenever I'm around any Packer fan, they've been very thankful. Um, and I appreciate that. And it means a lot. But, you know, it's time to Look forward to building my house, having my pool, and doing nothing for a while. <laughs> so it's finally to, you know, we had a lot of fun, and, it, you know, you stay so focused on it all. And I didn't realize it until, you know, I finally retired and was done, and your shoulders, like, drop because, you know, you set a bar so high mm -hmm. for yourself. It was a good relief when we finally made it, you know, and that's when I think we knew we were at peace, when you felt that, and it wasn't the second-guessing game. So um, to have that relief of, you know, now I can go play slow pitch softball on the weekends and <laughs> hang out with my family, and it is what it is. So um, 
But we had a heck of a run. We enjoyed it. It was 11 more years than what I ever thought, and um, we enjoyed every second. Well, Jordy, I'll remember you as a great teammate, a great leader, and a great friend. Oh, thank you, John. Oh yeah, young moolah baby.